Hey, hello everyone. Welcome to my channel, SAP SD and ABAB League Support. It is continuation series on SAP SD Support Project Real Time Tickets. There is an issue raised by business saying that for the single delivery, multiple invoices has been created. That's the issue they have raised. And they have mentioned one more thing is that they have maintained the split criteria in the customer master level as per delivery only. That means as per that uh, custom logic maintained in that uh, customer master, one delivery equal to one invoice. So one invoice will be created for one delivery. More than one invoice for one delivery is not allowed at all. I have published one uh, several videos on the invoice split and there is the, there's an uh, folder as well invoice split if you go through this, this uh, playlist then you will come to know what is the custom changes all about and how that works okay as per the custom changes split criteria has been maintained in the customer master you see they have maintained 19 19 means by delivery document number so whenever they maintain like this, then the system will allow to create one invoice for one delivery. Okay. But if you see here in VBRK table, you see combination criteria. This is nothing but Jukri field. Let me tell you that it's Jukri. Where do you carry? So Jukri field contains that good reason basically. Here we can see that here the delivery number is 8518. 9826. So there are two invoices. One created on 17th January. Second one created on 19th January. But with the same combination criteria. So when we analyze this, why two deliveries created, sorry, two invoices created for the same delivery, we understood that as per standard behavior, there is a bad job running every day. The job picks those delivery. So this delivery contains several orders in that. For example, this delivery contains 10, 10 orders. When, when it was creating the invoice for the first time on 17th January, it picked 8 orders. And, and for that 8 orders, invoice is created. And you see here in the log. So basically, this is the log what we see in that P.21. V.21 is a transaction code to see the badge of billing badge of logs. Let me show you that. So V.21 is a transaction code. And you see the type of quality run. It should be F. F means billing due list. Invoices from VF04. And uh, let me remove this started by. And if you click execute, you see this is the log. Okay. And this is the group ID and uh, created by, created on. And you see the number. That means this is nothing but created documents. So how many invoices has been created on this particular batch job run? If you select this and click on the documents, you see the invoices created by this batch job. Documents. Okay, here is nothing. Let me go with the, okay, let me start in descending order. Okay, and you see here on 30th February, 20 documents created. Let's see what are they. You see, you see here, right? These are the documents created by the batch jobs. The next immediate column shows the errors. So how many errors occurred during that bad job run? And if you see here, for example, 54 errors are there. And you see there is an icon notes. Documents will display the list of invoices created by the bad job and the notes will display the log for that bad job. If I click here, you see several uh, Documents are there with the reason. This is the delivery number or order number. 
and this is the document where we have the tissue right so when we analyze the tissue we understood that one of the order in the delivery contains a pricing issue you see pricing error in document so among 10 orders in the delivery 9 is or 9 or 8 is fine one is uh, there is an issue that is pricing issue due to that reason on uh, 17th one delivery is created one was created again uh, the job ran 18th as well 18th also there is an issue but when the job ran on 19th for the same delivery the pricing issue has been corrected in that order now no there is no issue in that order right pricing issue is fixed now now on 19th for that remaining order the pricing error order second invoice has been created for the same delivery okay so it is there is no issue here as per the custom logic invoice is getting created for delivery wise that's also working fine and as per standard logic also if any of that order is missing to create the invoice due to some errors in that order that time it won't be created and when it runs for the second time or third time uh, next consecutive days by job runs that time if there is, there is no issue definitely again invoice will be created for that by job i mean the delivery document so it's expected that to create two invoices for two deliveries because of this error only so whenever you analyze any bad job invoicing bad job issues you should always use this transaction code v.21 where we can see how many invoices created for that particular bad job run and uh, how many are been failed and what is the reason for the failure and one more thing what we can do this one table called vbfs vbfs so error log for collective processing right so here we see the group numbers right here we see the group numbers let's take this one and if i give this group number here and execute i will see all the technical information about this group badge of group okay and remember that this one will display only the errors only you see for this group number we have 54 entries are there and it's matching with this 54 entries this vbfs won't show the created invoices by the batch job it will show only the failed ones the reason for the failure of that some transactions so 54 are there and we can see the document number which item there is an issue and schedule a number and message id so on so we dot to one and vbfs the transaction code that we use let me note it down here vbfs it is for error log for collective processing so in case of any bad job issues uh, this is how we should analyze that and come to the conclusion thanks for watching my videos bye now